What's up guys, it's me, Spectrar here in another video in Cosmeteer. Um, I played a little bit on stream, so as you can see, I <laughs> added a really sick um, paint job to our ship since the last time we played. I don't, I was just messing around and then it ended up turning into like some kind of like Warhammer 40k orc ship. With maybe a little bit less red than what would normally be on those ships, but <laughs> at least that's what it looks like to me. <laughs> so, I don't know. It's weird. Uh, learned some stuff. Um, and I've acquired some good old cash. I don't know if it's going to be enough, but we've hit a point where we've done most of the, like, the tier one bounties. I'm a little scared to do these tier one to three. I don't really know what they are. Um... But I've been told that I should kind of maybe upgrade my ship a little bit before we try to do some of these like tier two ones. So, oops. Um, I kind of want to come in here and modify this ship a little bit. Um, we want, I think we want to make it a little bit bigger. I added these little deals to the side thinking they do a little bit more than they do. And, and so I'm not really convinced by them. Um, I think I might. Ooh, why did that? Oh, not pause. Not on pause. Anyways, let's. How do I get? How do I delete areas? I have to just delete stuff. Here we go. Delete tool. So let's go ahead and delete that. Delete that. Um. And I realize that this. Armor, this is hallway. Yeah. Okay, so let's go ahead and delete some of this armor. Actually, we probably should have. Can we do a control Z? We can. Let's leave that stuff there, but let's change up this stuff. Get rid of that. And we're just going to kind of make our ship a little bit bigger. Um, yeah, so I don't know how much of this I'll show because it kind of depends on how this all goes. I'm going to delete those two and let's get some armor going. If I can even find it. Let's go up a little bit more. Okay, so I've got this kind of up to here now. I want to do four guns. I'm going to keep it kind of in the same configuration it was, at least for this first ship. And then later on, probably in a stream, we'll design something better and play around with it in videos. Um, so I need to add some corridors. I want to add... I've got these crew members down here. I want to... Mm, let's see here. Let's look at crew stuff. This is good for two crew members. This is good for a bunch. So what I think I might do, actually, is do that. Add in that crew. How come... Oh, okay. I have to do that. Oh, it can only actually connect from that front side. Okay. Well, then let's re-delete that. This can hold six crew members. Oh, two. Kind of want to do that. That. Let's see here. Maybe one more like that. That seems all right. All right. Wait, that means I don't need to make this one all weird. 
do this. Make them all even. There we go. Um, yeah. And then let's... Uh, shoot. I should probably put a corridor here. Just so that everything can get to everywhere. And we'll maybe beep up the armor right here a little bit more. Okay, so added a bunch of thrusters in the back. I'm still new to the game, so I don't know if this is overkill or underkill yet. Um, but now that I look at it, I'm a little bit concerned that I didn't leave any room here for armor to protect this at all. Um, shoot. Ooh, auto-saving. Thank you. Let's... I know that looks kind of pretty in its symmetry, but we're going to do that, and we're actually going to delete... Keep trying to right-click to delete, and that doesn't work. We'll do one more corridor out. But that'll... Well, let's see what allowed what it allows us to do do a three-way thruster here um you know we're probably actually going to do the same thing again here as well um and i'm doing this okay to give us a little bit more mobility than we had last time yeah, and this will allow us to take this. Put that there. As well as that there. Yeah. And then I gotta decide to do what to do with this area. Um We haven't unlocked any, if hardly at all, any modules. Let's see, your stores are limited, cache of plasma batteries that may be used by nearby ship systems. Yeah. Maybe it'll be good to have some of those, or maybe we just need, maybe we just add some storage. It's not a bad idea. Just give us a little bit more storage to like help us collect stuff. Um trying to think if having another we were running low on money I just barely thought of looking at the money that's going to cost a lot <laughs> um, so let's just go back to storage storage is pretty cheap I can for now, just do this and really increase our storage. And maybe, yeah, so this stuff isn't really all that um, expensive. Absorbs a great deal of energy of enemy weapons. Hitting these ships. <coughs> Excuse me. Juicy innards also acts as a lightning rod for EMP effects. Okay, that's all of them. So what's the point of having the structure? Oh, that you can so you can build next to it. Okay, 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 okay. So let's just grab this, and we're gonna kind of just very boring like um, fill in to be a box. It doesn't look all that cool, but. I mean, we can try to do something kind of stylized, right? Let's do that. Add in... Uh, triangles, like that. All right. I mean, what's... I mean, is it eight metal worth of armor, maybe? I'm assuming it's less armor by doing this, but that's okay. We wanted to uh, poke these out more, 
and kind of have this trident looking kind of a deal. So that's not like ugly, right? <laughs> it's still doing stuff. Um, but I'm feeling much better about that. Do the weapons require energy? Uh, I can't remember. Guess I could have done power capacitors. We're gonna maybe maybe we'll try this. Let's look at our <laughs> our color scheme. And since we are doing crazy stuff, let's add more red. So we'll do Yeah, we'll do some of this. Let's find, is there a... Yeah. No, hold on. <laughs> this is gonna be so stupid. <laughs> no, we're gonna go ahead and do that. Oh, it didn't actually mirror. again oops going for the other side that I'm just missing okay you know what? we're gonna change it because I don't feel like taking the time to do this right now and I'm just wasting mine and yours time well, let's go ahead and unpause so they can build and do this stuff, so to speak. Yeah. Or red for speed. <laughs> oh wait, let's... Let's make sure we have, uh... red spear tips. Right? <laughs> who, who allowed me to have... <laughs> permission to have a painting for the whole when I'm like the least artistic person in the world and I'm at like times eight speed I don't want it I don't want that okay let's get out of this <laughs> it's such a stupid looking ship I'm so sorry everybody let's uh we need to buy some supplies Wait, do we have ammo? We don't have ammo anywhere. Okay. Yeah, so let's buy. So it's like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. For the four cannons. Um, let's initiate that trade. Let's see how that kind of fills up our cargo. Um, I imagine most of it will go in here. Okay, so I can do another, so that was like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and then the eighth one went into here. No ammo access. Wait, did I do that wrong? Oh no, it's fine. Um. Let's speed this up a little bit. Tail them again. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. 
Then let's also one two one two for um, repairs with the steel and the coils while we're out there. Okay. Let's do a couple more stacks of ammo, just to be sure. Okay, and then we can come over here. Let's see here. Let's attempt this level two station rescue, right? Oh, no, wait, hold on. We need to, we need more people. We need more people. So let's just hire these bad boys. Okay. And we will accept that. Good auto save. We'll do a quick save just in case. Uh, I think we have everybody. Yeah, look at everybody playing around in their beds. Okay, let's take this down to normal speed. And then let's go figure out where the station is that I'm supposed to go to. Where is it? Uh... Is it further out in space? Am I just blind? Where is it? That's... Ooh. No, I feel like I should be in this system. Unknown signal, unknown signals. Rescue Vasquez Station. Uh, is Vasquez down about somewhere? There's no way it's asking me to go up there. All right. Oh, it's this one right here. Okay, unknown signal, rescue Vasquez station. Oh, jeez, I'm an idiot. Okay. Let's get out of there and go fight some bad guys. Okay, contacts. Let's go get them. We need to destroy a bunch of stuff. Come on, me. And they've got to survive. So hopefully that works. We will start off by killing this guy. Oh boy, we already killed someone. Oh, it's right click. There we go. Go my four cannons. Come on, baby. See, this guy's concerning because he's fast. And if I let him get too far out of range, I'll never catch him. Okay, good. He's... Did like a little panic there because I was starting to destroy him. Go me. Okay. Now let's hurry and turn and kill this guy. Still got all of our engines. Our front is taking some damage. Boom. Okay. Receive payment from Vasca Station. Sweet. Let's... Ooh, we took lots of damage all over the place. That's okay. Things were surviving, though. Nothing was, like, fully broken except for a little bit of armor. Sweet. Ooh, uh, let's not break the station, maybe. Awesome. Receive payment, please. Ooh, look at all these level two fugitive bounties. Yeah, let's go try that. Eliminate a Phalanx. Oh no, Phalanx? 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 I don't know how to say that word. It's not Phalanx, because then the N and the A would be first. Phalanx. <laughs> I feel so stupid trying to. Okay, you know what? Forget it. We'll we're gonna accept two of these. 
Real quick though, how are we doing on ammo? We went through a decent amount. I wish I could move that ammo up there, but that's fine. Okay. Yeah, okay. Um, where are our targets? Fugitive Bounty, Fugitive Bounty. Well, let's go to this one first. Because why not? Hey, look at us. I think the three engines on each side was just enough. Almost could have done more. But it's okay. And I think we have a decent amount of rotation, even though... I would assume power distribution is a little bit sketchy with only one generator. It seems to be holding up pretty decently, though. I tried to set up so that I had a guy in each turret, theoretically a guy resupplying each one, and then the rest could focus on energy distribution. And like it seems to work okay. Yeah. Now, where is this fugitive? Okay, here he is. Let's see how we do. Another thing I'm probably gonna have to do is I need to look up what other people do for ships. Let's get a good zoom in on this guy getting just absolutely destroyed. Yeah, with these four cannons, we're, we're looking pretty hot, I think. Um, yeah, we can probably take on stuff that's a little bit bigger than this, but let's go ahead and take, uh, go towards this other, uh, fugitive bounty. Contact, unknown contact, get him. Let's do good, zoom in. Actually, you know what? Let's look at how our guys are doing inside wait hold on it's just the here we go look on they're distributing ammo good and I guess since these don't need a lot of energy these guys are just keeping these guys fully reloaded and then going back down to distribute energy as needed interesting to where this guy's almost getting each one's almost getting like two to three people just keeping them loaded and so they can just unload like a machine gun. Interesting. I didn't see that as like a benefit until just now. Hmm. And I know like things get really fancy with like crew management, which we'll get into eventually. Uh, right now, just everyone's a red shirt doing whatever, doing everything. But I might be able to like keep them more uh, task focused to where a certain group only deals with like reactor energy distribution. Um, oh, this is cool. So we can see who's where. So we have a guy all the way up in the cannons from this. Okay. Interesting. Fair enough. It's a little bit of a hot spot doing that. Are we getting attacked? No, we are not. Let's collect our bounties. Don't run into the station! Ooh, that was close. I wonder if there's any negative reputation, which is fame. That's what it is. I get a fame from running into them? I'm assuming not. We've almost already hit the limit for some of these level 2 ones. We are getting way more money for these uh, missions, which is Awesome. Um, before we end, I'm actually tempted to try this pirate hunt. Since it's having us eliminate so many. Let's get a little bit more ammo. Um, and then, how are we doing on people? Is everyone still alive? Everyone's still alive. And then let's prepare everything. We'll do a quick save. We need to make sure we are topped off ammo-wise. 
That's not bad, but I'm going to get a little bit more since we're fighting so many pirates. Um, let's do another five. One, two, three, four, five, six. Just because we're feeling really cool. I um, <laughs> don't think that's actually the case. Wait for our massive delivery. Yeah, I think it's okay that we're hitting up a little bit more of our storage back here. Um, okay. Now, let's figure out where this cooler, bigger mission is. Um, once I'm no longer stupid and okay, give me a second to figure out where this is. Oh, it's just eliminate roving pirates. So I just need to like fly around almost aimlessly and hope I run into a pirate somewhere. I guess we'll try that. Okay, here's a uh, unknown contact. Let's see if eliminating this guy ups our number of eliminated roaming pirates. Let's get a good close in on our destruction. This guy's firing lasers. Are we firing? There we go. Not as accurate, which is fine. But man, it sure tears through them like crazy. Okay, that did not actually uh, up our count. So where am I supposed to go? I'm assuming that was a pirate. Unknown signal. These are all just regular unknown signals, not with like the prefix of like, hey, here's your mission. Well, I'll keep flying around, I guess. Maybe that ship wasn't technically a pirate. Maybe it was a fugitive. And I wasn't paying attention. Well, here's another contact. We'll try again and maybe try to take a look at what he is. Still just a Regulus. I guess we'll see. Hmm. What's our ship doing? Ooh, we're taking a lot of hits this time. Come on, baby. Come on, guys. He's really punching through there. He's going to hit the crew quarters soon. Ooh, we are not hurting him. Let's try to, like, go after the side, maybe. After these guns. I can kind of target modules, but our guys are really inaccurate. Oh, he's got a shield. Ew. Let's try to get past that. Is that the shield right there? Yeah. Let's try to take out the shield generator. It's not firing back much anymore. Okay, we're finally breaking through. We're hurting a little bit on the nose, but that's okay. Come on. Oh, we were hurting him. And it stopped. Interesting. I don't know what to do. Aim at this one. Am I, am, I, am I out of ammo? Oh my gosh, I am running out of ammo. Oh shoot, did I quick save before this? I am out of ammo. Oh, no, I'm not. I still got a little bit. It's just taking forever. Oh, God, and they're destroying. <laughs> All hands lost. Shoot. Okay, fair enough. So, a tier three ship has got a lot of little goodies. Um, let's look at quick saves. Uh... We're okay going to this one. I don't remember which mission this was before. I think we had saved. Yeah, we haven't. We had at least saved the Vascast station. Um. 
Runner Barrel. Looks like I just bought a bunch of ammo. Okay, fair enough. Well, let's... Out of curiosity, let's hail a station again. Because I know I can unlock ship parts, which we can start exploring in stream or in the next video. And that's a question I have for you guys is... Would it upset you if I play this game a bunch on stream and the videos for this game aren't necessarily... They'll have, like, time skips of, like, progress I've made? Or would you rather me make some progress on stream, but, like, major events, like building a new ship like this, or, like, going on bigger missions, I try to stick to videos for YouTube. Let me know if you have a preference. We're gonna go ahead and, like, unlock this laser. We're gonna... Unlock the bigger cannon. Let's see here. There's two large laser guns and a single turret. Okay. Sure, we'll go ahead and unlock that. Fires bolts of electric energy that deal a little bit of damage but can short circuit enemy systems. Ooh, I like that. Uh, A little bit of enough on that kind of weapons. Let's see what we can do for... This. We haven't had a need for flak yet. Small shield generator, yes. Um, we'll not get the large yet. How's the ship to instantaneously travel to other destinations? No, let's not worry about that yet. How's the ship to fly and coordinate the weapon by providing more command points? That's important, I think. So we'll get that one for now. Um. Uh... Let's ignore that for now. Um, I don't think we need a moving hallway right now. Maybe even a medium reactor. We're losing a lot of money, but I think we can take our ship out on some regular missions and have plenty. This cannon ammo factory seems really important to me. I remember seeing that when I was looking through this earlier. Some mining stuff. I don't think we need small explosive device that can be manually detonated primarily used for deliberately splitting ships into multiple pieces what so I can have like a a full ship and like split it into a bunch of pieces interesting um yeah I think that's what we'll stick to for now and I think we might end the video here let me know your thoughts I've been kind of enjoying exploring this game um, and I will see you hopefully in the next one. See ya.